Hi, welcome back to my channel. This is Sam, my name is Sam, and this is uh, Sam's single mode channel. And today is the, is the last day of the year. This is the last video I'm gonna make in 2021. And waiting for 2022 is uh, New Year's Eve. And uh, I'm making this, this video quite quickly so we get all things sorted to celebrate the New Year's Eve. Um, so I wanted to I wanted to have this last video, New Year's Eve video, with a special special single mold. And um, as a drinker, as a no, as a professional, but as a buyer. Um, the looking is is one interesting thing that attracts your attention, and um, for New Year's Eve, it's nothing better than a, than a golden golden whiskey. Yeah, here we go, the Glenfiddich IPA. Look at that! It's a golden presentation in a triangle tube. Um, as a Glenfiddich, it's beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. So this is IPA, IPA experiment. So this is the experiment number one. Glenfiddich IPA experiment number one. So starting from there, the color, and then the name. It's just, um, just then, just by, with that. Uh, makes it exciting and attractive um, gives you things to talk to share about like IPA uh, India PL it's a it's a type of beer it's a type of beer what a beer has to do with Glenfiddich the um, the biggest seller of uh, single malt mm? um, yeah, well, this is an experiment. Don't forget that. So, the experiment um, then fitted with a local distillery in Speyside. Um, they play with this um, with this thing. What did what did they do? They they use um, Glenfiddich barrels, so ex bourbon barrels that they've been. They had a uh, Glenfiddich in there. They took, they take the um, the whiskey out and pour the barrels with with this um, beer IPA and keep the the barrels with beer for for four weeks four weeks yeah for four weeks so then the flavors or well it's an experiment let's think that at that stage they didn't know what was happening so but the idea was to try and and, and see what the the barrel would absorb and um, and turn into after being a beer container so that's what they did and then they empty it. I wonder how that beer tastes anyway. I would love to try that beer, but yeah, I, I would follow it and might try it somehow. I I I drink IPA, I, I drink a IPA beer. Anyway, so those barrels, they empty the barrels that they have had uh, um, that IPA beer for four weeks. And um, and pour the Glenfiddich single mold back into that barrel and keep it for three months. Um, so yeah, and uh, after that, uh, that's what we have. The um, Glenfiddich IPA experiment number one at the 43%. So the, um, this box and the bottle doesn't they don't state the the year they don't 
So we don't know how many years they've been in the barrel without considering the 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 time with the with the IPA, but they we don't know how old this whiskey is. So I, I got the Glenfiddich 12 years old here just to to compare somehow or a starting point where to where to compare and and see um, how they how they are how different they would be. So yeah, I'm gonna have a little bit of um, Glenfiddich 12 years old. So this bottle was given to me by my my lovely nephew John. So John gave me this uh, Glenfiddich 12 years old for my birthday. So it's my birthday present. Here we go. Glenfiddich 12. And we have the Glenfiddich IPA. I, I love, I love the the box. It's just so nice. And look at this. Look at the bottle. It's just beautiful. Oh, that light is so annoying. But. Um, yeah, it's a it's a dark glass. It's a dark glass. You don't see the the color of the whiskey inside. And um, and yeah, all golden letters, wooden cork. The finishing, the looking is just it's a very very beautiful bottle. And um, this Glenfiddich IPA was my Christmas present from my nephew John. Look at that. So he's a Glenfiddich fan, I, guess, I suppose. <laughs> it feels different straight away. It feels uh, thicker somehow. Somehow it, the, um, the Glenfiddich IPA, it looks thicker than uh, than the, um, the Glenfiddich 12 the color very similar very similar I would say the the IPA is a little bit lighter I would say they are almost the same or they are the other same, maybe. I don't know, this one looks slightly lighter. Mm. Mm. Yeah, let's leave it for some time. Um, so, IPA, India PL, is a bit. Um, beer. Um, the story says that the, when um, when India was a British colony uh, they would send a beer from England to to India for the for the British living in uh, in India. That's in the 1600. So that trip would take about five months and, um, and yeah of course the beer would die on the way so in one stage someone apparently the sailors they add some hops to the beer so the barrels they cover the the, the barrels with the hops um, as a, a, to preserve the beer and it did work, but it also add a bit of flavor to the beer. So the beer they were receiving 
in um, in India that time it would be a stronger, stronger flavor and very hoppy. Um, but yeah, then become very popular. It's, I have, I think it's one of the most popular beers in the world. Anyway, that's IPA, and we have Glenfiddich IPA. We suggest you that it might be, might be a little bit bitter, might be a little bit um, herby. Very similar. Mm. I love doing these videos, it's just <laughs> I, I enjoy in a It's, um, the IPA feels are more feels more mature, more yeah, it feels more mature, more co complex, a bit more complex than than the Glenfiddich Twelve. It's less. Um, less alcohol and um, so I would I would guess my guess would be that Glenfiddich IPA is um, is probably 14 years old yeah pretty close to the 15 years old which is very nice too but yeah it's got those um, fresh flu fresh fruit the um, aromas and a little bit of kind of um mold multi and um yeah just a little bit but it's definitely definitely different different to, to this one it feels younger the Glenfiddich 12 yep so we got the, the sweetness we got the, um, the traditional fruity sweet and uh, a little bit herbal on the nose so evident it's not so evident the sweetness it is there but it's also together with some bitters some grapefruit and lime um, the the apples and pears maybe a little bit vanilla a bit of um, pineapple would be but just a, a tiny bit and um, then there is a bitter part of it it's, there is something bitter that stays in the mouth and uh, yeah reminds me a lot of um, the IPA beer it's not like drinking the beer at all but maybe because I know it's a Glenfiddich IPA I, uh, but it is it is different it's not it's not the 
a classic um, space side and it is enjoyable it's got that that bit that mysterious bitterness that that is not too much either so it gives a, it's, it is special and it, it's nice um I would say it's one of my favorite Glen Fiddy I've tried. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's my opinion about this Glen Fiddy IPA. Um, so this is my last video of the year, the year 2021. New Year's re resolution: lose some weight. Oh, yeah, I want to lose some weight. So that's one thing I'm not gonna join the the gym because I'm, <laughs> it's gonna be for two days. But that's one thing, and another thing I'm gonna change. I'm gonna change the um, my set. I'm gonna make um, something different for the year 2022. I still don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm the designer. I'm the builder. I'm the director. I'm the I'm the sonidist. Some sound effects and and all those uh, those things so yeah I hope uh, you follow me and then we see what we come up with next year uh, I wish you the best for 2022 um, happy new year